Now, this was nice. We sort of had an up and down week, but Zach, as we go into the weekend, looking pretty good. Absolutely. The sunshine is going to continue for the first part of our Father's Day weekend, but we did see pokes of blue sky today, where our temperatures actually followed suit. We got back to where we should be for this time of year. The average is 76 degrees. That's what Logan officially came in at yesterday. If you remember, obviously the dreary and the cloudy conditions kept us on the cooler side, but we are going to see increasing temperatures as we move into tomorrow afternoon. At this point, we've seen our temperatures slip a little bit. We're into the low and mid 60s once we move out towards Worcester County and the higher elevations of western Massachusetts, even falling into the upper 50s around the Berkshires, but still holding on to 71 degrees in Boston itself and a little bit cooler down towards the south coast. And that is actually going to be the trend for the Cape and the islands over the next two afternoons. There was a wave of energy that was bringing at least some sprinkles out towards Metro West, maybe making it in parts of the Mass Pike, but overall it didn't really reach the 495 corridor and no one on coastal locations saw any activity today. And at this point, we're starting to move some of those clouds around, but you may notice some of this white lingering on the screen. This is going to be the case over the next few hours. We don't seem to sweep those away until we move into overnight. Mild temperatures are going to kick off our weekend. So by the time we wake up tomorrow morning, we're doing just fine. With sunny skies, temperatures are going to rebound quite nicely into the low 80s for our afternoon highs in most locations away from the water. There is going to be a coastal influence. But enjoy Saturday for what it is because by the time Sunday rolls around, we're going to deal with another round of rain. But this one, not too widespread. We see some hit or miss chances in the morning for the higher elevations. But there is enough lingering moisture around to allow part of Massachusetts to sweep in a few scattered showers for the middle to later parts of the afternoon. Not a washout by any means, but for your grilling plans, I'm thinking more so towards dinner time. This may deter some of the outdoor things you have going on. Everything else seeming looking okay. We're going to be back into the low 80s tomorrow afternoon. Cooler down towards the Cape as Hyannis is registering 75 degrees for a high tomorrow. Father's Day itself, the showers are really going to be reserved out towards the northwest. Temperature is obviously going to take a hit, and it will be a bit humid. So if your travels are going to take you up towards the lakes and the mountains, you're trying to escape that humidity, Sunday still has the better chance of showers. Now, if you're moving out towards the beaches, you're going to be a little bit cooler. And we're also going to introduce a breeze. And this wind may kick up enough to bring gusts around 30 to maybe even 35 miles per hour. Not damaging by any means, but definitely turbulent for boaters. Anyone that plans to go fishing, probably going to have to battle some white caps. And we keep these conditions around for the beginning of next week week, which is also kicking off school vacation for many school districts. But Monday still introduces some rain. We keep those showers around through Tuesday morning. Wednesday seems to be the pick at 74 degrees. It's a little bit cooler, but the sunshine is going to be around from morning to evening. Thursday, we start increasing the clouds, and that's associated with the rain by Friday. All right, Zach, thank you so much.